morning guys I have a late start to the day um, today is Wednesday March 21st and unfortunately I am NOT at work today because yesterday I did end up going to the hospital I went to the emergency room for my heartburn it just would not go away and I had a really bad experience with kidney stones one time and like it just made more sense for me to go to the ER for it instead of sitting here waiting around like going to doctors multiple times until they figured out what to do. Um, they gave me medicine and I have a follow-up appointment because it might be ulcers. So yeah, just struggle bus for real. Um, but it's okay. Because the medicine, I'm starting the medicine they gave me today. It's called Oniplexin. Uh, I think it's like the prescription strength of like Nexium or what's that? Prilosec. So my insurance does like cover that. So that's pretty cool. But I am going to start taking that today. It takes like two days to kick in. And then I got this other stuff. Um, it's like kind of like. I feel like a child. I feel like a, a child taking this medicine, but it's in this huge bottle, and it's pretty helpful. So it is now like almost 11 o'clock in the afternoon. I'm just waking up because I was up super late last night, not feeling well, but I feel bomb right now. So I'm gonna take the medicine, wait like an hour, and then eat, and then hopefully I won't get heartburn from eating, especially since I'm not eating like terrible for me, like food that's terrible for me. Y'all, we just hit a new low weigh in today, 159.8. 159.8. Is that freaking nuts? That's freaking nuts. Um, that's freaking nuts. Like, 159.8, I'm under 160. Granted, this could be like water weight, but 159.8, what? Holy shit. We're watching Christian's newest video, so. I'm just like catching up on YouTube videos and I was getting ready to eat so I figured I'd show you. This is something that I meal prepped. It's just spinach and egg whites and protein pancakes. So I prepared that for lunch and I'm going to be staying on schedule even though I'm home. I took my medicine about an hour and a half ago so I should be okay. No. No. Happy Sunday. Finally going to the gym. I feel like way better right now, but I wanted to show you my outfit, I guess. And I set up this mirror um, today so that I can actually use it for selfies. Les selfies. Anyways, this is what I'm wearing. Okay, so I just gym. finished at the gym and basically like I couldn't record because there was a ton of people in there and like everyone was old. So I also had like really embarrassing things like happen. Like this old lady, I guess, doesn't understand supersets. And it was like super freaking awkward. Like she basically just like took my equipment away from me, which annoyed the f It was just really annoying. I was filming this guy was sitting in his car. It just looked at me like, who is she talking to? But you know, it's, it's whatever, it's life. I freaking just need to like have courage in film and every time it's just so difficult like I don't know why it's hard for me but I have to go pick up stuff for my boss and then I'm going to go jewelry shopping with my godson and my bestie Emily so her name's not really Emily I just call her that her name's Emily but I realized every vlog that I say her name I say Emily so we about to go do this and I also need to eat something, which I'm kind of scared because I probably should have taken my medicine before, but it'll be okay. So we're it'll eating be okay. all you can eat sushi. We're eating soup right now, but it looks really yummy. Kalyan. Who's that? 
Thank you. What is that? Yes. Is that the one that we didn't What are you time? eating? French fries? <clears throat> no. Yeah. Oh, thank you. Uh, no. This is the one I ordered last time. The mango shrimp. Uh-huh. And then this one is not one I wanted to try this time. Oh. It's like extra. I don't remember the name. Uh-huh. And then that's and the asparagus are, one. Yeah, asparagus. And this is the tempura one, right? Yeah. I ordered another bowl of soup and edamame. And Emily ordered. Because fries are life. Right, guys, so we just made it home. I am so full. I have to sit down. Like, my stomach is literally like, that's how bad it is. I'm like dying in pain. So, I'm about to go. I'll see you guys in the next video. Thank you for watching. Make sure you subscribe if you're new, and I'll talk to you guys soon. Tomorrow. Hey y'all, welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's Shantae Marie here. I'm a lifestyle vlogger here on the tube. If you are new, welcome. Make sure you hit the subscribe button so you can see more videos like this. And yeah, I guess that's all I have to say for my little intro, but we are getting ready to have a good day, I guess. I just got off of work. Bruh, don't be barking. Bruh. My dog is being crazy. So, um, we're getting ready to go like on a walk or something with the dogs and then I'm going to be going to the gym and I'm getting ready to open some mail that I just got so I'll show you guys that and I need to eat a snack because I'm starving so all right so this is what it came with it says I hope you love me but if you didn't and then that's just the returns and exchanges cards I think that's so cute and it came with this for you to be able to snap them it's so cute and then I purchased this nude bikini and this red one. So we're going to try these on. I tried the swimming suits on. They're pretty cute. I was going to show you guys, but then I was like, nah, I'm not going to show you because I just, I don't know. I would rather it be a surprise like at the end of all of this. So I've been ordering swimming suits like a crazy person because I just like have ideas in mind of what I would like to look like in certain swimming suits. So I'm about to eat some watermelon. So this is what we are going to actually eat. Let me get some light in here. Oh my God. All right guys. So this is what we're eating. The almond butter, um, rice cakes, and two pieces of watermelon. And I'm also drinking some water because I don't feel like I did a good job today of drinking water. I never feel like I did a good job drinking water. Anyways, anyways, we are going to be talking about acid reflux disease in this video because I figure I may as well make the video educational. And I have my handy dandy notes section because I made notes of what the doctors told me to do. So, number one is going to be to just eat smaller meals in general, which as you saw, as you saw in the video of yesterday, um, your girl has a problem with overeating. Uh, I just have a problem, I don't know why. I love to eat and I honestly could be like a food challenge person because I love eating that much, but smaller meals are going to help so like I get in so much pain that like I am going to force myself to stop overeating number two consume fewer calories I feel like that kind of goes hand in hand with the smaller meals situation like I'm not really tripping about calories like I just need to like make smarter choices I guess and eat more smaller meals than having like 
one giant meal because that's kind of what I did yesterday. And then give three hours between eating and bedtime, which I told you guys in a previous video that it doesn't matter when you eat as long as the food that you eat is correct, which I do feel that that is true. But for me, since I have acid reflux disease, it doesn't make sense for me to go and lay down immediately after eating. Like I just shouldn't do that because of the way that our bodies work. Um, there's even like, you're supposed to sleep like on your left hand side because of the way that the acid like works in your stomach, like that helps you. Um, eat slowly, definitely suck at that. I'm really bad at eating slow. Like I'm usually so hungry that when I eat, I'm just like food and then I shovel it into my face or like I'm at work or like doing something for the military where I'm trying to hurry and like get back to work. So that's hard for me. I have to focus on that. Then avoiding trigger foods. This is like the biggest thing. Hot and spicy food, high in saturated fat or trans fats, coffee, that was a disappointment. Tomatoes and tomato products, that was somewhat of a disappointment, but it's easy for me to cut that out. I don't, I don't really, like tomatoes aren't a huge thing for me. And chocolate, once again, doesn't bother me if I don't have to eat it. Alcohol, that bothers me. Carbonated beverages, refined sugars in excess, citrus and mint. So those are things to avoid, or I guess like if I know that I didn't take my medicine, then I probably shouldn't consume those things. Did you have a good walk? Yeah. Did you? Yeah. <laughs> You're so cute. Oh, Bubby. All right, y'all. I unfortunately didn't film very much in there just because I realized what time it was, and it's late as fuck, and I can't eat. I need to be not eating at nine o'clock at night, so we're in a rush to get to so Panera. From Panera. We basically got the same thing that we always get. Honestly, I'm not creative. I guess Asian sesame chicken salad, the full size. And, okay, I've never tried this, actually. Chicken wild rice soup is what I ordered, and this certainly looks like broccoli mother effing cheddar. Nope, never mind. I lied. It just looks like it. Anyway. And take myself to bed. Okay, I'm not going to go straight to bed, because I just said in this video not to do that, so we're not going to do that, but we're going to, like, watch some TV and then go to bed. And I think I might go... To the gym tomorrow morning instead because I'm I like going in the morning it's just so much better I don't know how to explain it but it's better but anyways thank you guys so much for tuning in to this vlog summer shredding is going really well like I feel like I feel good so if you're new make sure you hit the subscribe and turn on notifications if you want to keep seeing videos like this and I will catch you in my next one